Welcome to The Reality Revolution. I'm your host, Brian Scott. And today we're going to talk about time, in particular, manipulating time. In particular, I want to talk about temporal folding, a concept I discussed in my video, Reality Surfing, or also Quantum Surfing into New Realities. Time is one of the most essential elements to understand in our ongoing quest to create our own realities. Manipulating time is a concept that may initially defy everything you've understood about time. This episode is not just about theories and practices. It's an invitation for you to reimagine the way that you live your life. Time as we know it has always been a linear, unyielding constant in your life. You are born, you live, and you age all under the ever ticking clock of time. Your days are structured around it. Your society is built upon it and your life in many ways is enslaved by it. But what if I told you that time, the seemingly invincible dictator can be molded, bent, and even folded. Temporal folding is the art of manipulating one's perception of time to accelerate the realization of desired outcomes. It's about learning to interact with time in a way that transcends the traditional tick-tock, opening doors to experiences and possibilities that would otherwise seem unattainable. In our fast-paced world, the constant race against time creates an undercurrent of stress and urgency. We're often left wishing for more hours in the day, yearning to slow down the moments we cherish or hasten the arrival of awaited events. Temporal folding addresses the very real need, the need to transcend the limitations imposed by conventional time. So this is about breaking free from the chronological shackles. Imagine being able to speed up the process of achieving your goals or slowing down time to savor the moments that make life worth living. Manipulating time offers a pathway to do just that. It's not about defying the laws of physics, but mastering the art of perception where a minute can be stretched into an hour or an hour condensed into a moment. Imagine an ambitious professional striving for a promotion and despite her hard work, the process is agonizingly slow. So she practices temporal folding by visualizing her days as being more productive and her interactions as more impactful. She mentally fast forwards through unnecessary delays and imagines weeks of progress happening in days. Over time, she notices her projects moving faster, her ideas gaining quicker acceptance and her goal of promotion rapidly approaching. Or envision a student that feels he doesn't have enough time to develop his skills in music alongside his studies. So using these temporal folding techniques, he alters his perception of time. During the practice sessions, he enters a state where time seems to expand, allowing him to practice for what feels like hours in a much shorter period. This intense focused practice leads to accelerated learning and skill development. There's the person who's recovering from an emotional setback and feels like the healing process is taking forever. And so, they apply temporal folding by imagining their days moving swiftly, seeing themselves rapidly gaining strength and emotional stability. They visualize a future where they already are healed, bringing that feeling into their present, which helps speed up their recovery. Someone on vacation that's been looking forward to it, but it seems that it's passing by too quickly. So you practice these techniques by immersing yourself fully in each moment, and then you're able to slow down your perception of time. Another example is someone who has a dream of starting their own business, but they feel overwhelmed by the amount of time it requires. Instead of just giving up, they utilize temporal folding by breaking down their goal into smaller manageable tasks and visualizing each being completed in an accelerated time frame. This approach reduces their overwhelm and helps them move towards their goal more quickly than they thought possible. Historically, time has been perceived as a linear progression, a constant, unyielding flow from the past, through the present, and into the future. 
and this view aligns with our everyday experiences the sun rises and sets the seasons change in a cycle and we age continuously for centuries this linear perspective of time has shaped our society our philosophy and our personal life the advent of modern science particularly quantum physics has radically shifted our understanding of time the discovery that the fundamental laws of the universe may not experience time linearly has opened doors to astonishing possibilities quantum theory suggests that at the subatomic level particles might interact in ways where the distinction between past present and future becomes blurred building on these groundbreaking scientific insights we introduce the concept of time as a malleable dimension this perspective views time not as a fixed sequence of events but as a fluid dynamic continuum that can be shaped and altered imagine time as a river while it seems to flow in one direction under certain circumstances it can meander form eddies or even appear to stand still Albert Einstein's theory of relativity brought to light that time is not an absolute universal constant it can vary depending on speed and gravity bending in response to the universe's forces this scientific truth mirrors our subjective experiences think of how time flies when you're having fun or drags during moments of boredom our perception of time can stretch and compress influenced by our emotions activities and states of consciousness consider the phenomenon of dreaming in dreams we can experience what feels like days months or even years all within a few hours of sleep this elasticity of time in our subconscious state hints at the inherent flexibility of time a concept we can potentially harness in our waking lives i've included this dimension in several sleep meditations and i've used this successfully imagining all the different possibilities within a five-year period of time while i'm meditating in a sleep state has allowed for me to see incredible futures and probabilities as we delve into this remember this important truth time is not just a ticking clock on the wall it's a dimension as vast and malleable as space itself your journey is not just about learning to bend time but about redefining your relationship with this most precious aspect of your existence i mean think about it if there is one universal currency that transcends all others it is time it's the one commodity that even the wealthiest person cannot accumulate hoard or purchase time is the great equalizer impartial and unyielding allotted to each of us in unknown finite quantities consider the wealthiest individual on earth their fortune can buy luxuries influence and power at the one frontier they cannot conquer is time for all their wealth they like everyone else are bound by the 24 hours of each day the realization dawns that being prosperous in time is far more significant than being prosperous in money imagine the moments that money can't buy the first steps of a child the warmth of a shared laughter the quiet peace of a sunrise these are instances where time becomes more precious than any material wealth the richest person might own the most luxurious yacht but they too are subject to the same relentless ticking of time as anyone else in your life you often find yourself making trade-offs between time and money you spend hours working to earn money but in doing so you exchange precious moments of your life this trade-off highlights a fundamental truth while you can always earn more money the time spent cannot be reclaimed the wealthiest person on their deathbed would willingly trade all their riches for a little more time being prosperous in time is about more than just having free hours it's about how those hours are filled it's the quality not just the quantity of time that matters a life rich in time is one where moments are spent meaningfully with purpose joy and fulfillment this form of prosperity yields memories and experiences that become the treasured wealth of our lives interestingly there's often a paradox at play those who chase material wealth may often find themselves impoverished in time in contrast those who value and manage their time effectively often find a wealth of experience and contentment that money cannot provide 
The first step is to acknowledge and understand the immense value of time. It's about shifting the perspective from seeing time as fleeting, uncontrollable, to viewing it as the most significant form of wealth we possess. This realization is the cornerstone of learning how to manipulate and maximize time, transforming it from a finite resource into a wellspring of endless potential. Manipulating time through temporal folding is an intriguing concept that transcends the traditional boundaries of time perception. At its core, it's the art and science of manipulating one's perception of time, allowing for a subjective acceleration or deceleration of experiences. This manipulation isn't about changing time itself, but about altering our interaction and experience with it. It's akin to folding a paper shortening the distance between two points, not by moving the points closer, but by bringing them together through the fold. The idea of manipulating time can be traced back through various historical and cultural lenses. Ancient civilizations, from the Mayans to the Egyptians, had their unique interpretations of time, often viewing it as a cyclical or layered phenomenon rather than linear. In Eastern philosophies, time has often been perceived as an illusion, a concept deeply rooted in Buddhist and Hindu teachings where the flow of time is seen as malleable and subjective. Throughout history, philosophers have pondered the nature of time, from St. Augustine's reflections on the nature of the present to Einstein's revelations about time's relativity. The concept of time has been a subject of endless fascination and debate. In more esoteric philosophies, time has been viewed as a fabric that can be folded or bent, allowing for experiences like deja vu, premonitions, and even astral travel. Temporal folding as a named concept is a relatively modern development emerging from the confluence of ancient wisdom and modern scientific understanding. It proposes that just as space can be folded to create shortcuts, a concept familiar in theoretical physics, time too can be folded for experiential shortcuts. This idea is about more than a mere time management, it's about time mastery. In quantum physics, time has been shown to be far more malleable than previously thought. Theoretical models suggest the possibility of phenomena like time dilation and wormholes, offering scientific credence to the idea of temporal folding. These concepts, while still largely theoretical, provide a framework for understanding how time can be manipulated on a subjective level. In today's context, temporal folding has moved beyond the realms of philosophy and theoretical physics into practical applications. It is seen as a tool for personal development, a method to enhance mindfulness, and a means to achieve goals more efficiently. Contemporary interpretations of temporal folding combine age-old wisdom with modern techniques of visualization, meditation, and cognitive restructuring to manipulate one's perception of time. Now, central to this is the power of perception. Our perception of time influences how we experience it. By altering this perception, we can effectively fold our experience of time, expanding moments of joy and compressing periods of discomfort. Manipulating time, in theory, is a complex but fascinating concept. It hinges on the idea that our perception and experience of time can be altered, not linearly, but through a process similar to folding space. The first step in understanding this temporal folding technique of manipulating time is recognizing the malleability of time as a perceptual experience. Traditionally, time is seen as a constant flow, but modern physics, particularly theories surrounding space-time and relativity, suggest that time can be experienced at different rates. This is theorizing that we can intentionally manipulate this rate of experience, shortening or lengthening our perception of time's passage. The relationship between consciousness and time is at the heart of what I'm talking about. Consciousness is not just a passive observer of a preset timeline. It is an active participant in shaping the experience of time. The state of our consciousness, whether we are focused, distracted, relaxed, or stressed, significantly influences our perception of how quickly or slowly time passes. Intention is the steering wheel of manipulating time. Setting a clear intention acts as a directive for our consciousness, telling it how to perceive the passage of time. 
For instance, when we intend to achieve a state of flow in our work, time might seem to speed up with hours passing like minutes. Conversely, intending to savor a moment can slow down time, making brief moments rich and expansive. Focus plays a critical role in the practice of time manipulation. It's the engine that powers the entire process. By focusing our mind, we can anchor our consciousness in the desired perception of time. This focus state can be achieved through various practices like meditation, visualization, and other specific exercises that I will cover here. This requires a harmonious alignment of cognitive and emotional states. Our thoughts, beliefs, and emotions need to be in sync with our intention of how we want to experience time. This alignment creates a synergy that enhances our ability to fold time according to our will. Visualization is a potent tool in temporal folding by vividly imagining a scenario where time is folding in the desired manner, we reinforce our intention and focus. This can involve visualizing a clock's hands moving at different speeds or picturing oneself moving through a fast forwarded or slow motion scene. In practice, this might involve techniques like time compression during work to increase productivity or time expansion during leisure to enhance relaxation and enjoyment. The key is in the consistent application of focus, intention, and alignment of one's cognitive and emotional state. The mechanics of time manipulation opens up a new dimension of time mastery. It empowers us to not just passively experience time, but to actively shape it. It all begins in the mind. It's essential to prepare mentally and emotionally to effectively manipulate the perception of time. How do we align our mind and emotions? First, recognize that your thoughts and emotions are deeply interconnected and play a significant role in your perception of time. An anxious mind often feels time slipping away rapidly, while a relaxed mind can perceive time as moving more slowly. You should engage in activities that harmonize your thoughts and feelings. This could include journaling, which helps in aligning your emotional state with your cognitive processes or engaging in creative activities that foster a sense of flow and timelessness. Of course, we can use meditation. This includes mindfulness to enhance our awareness of the present moment, guided visualization and breathing techniques, which help in achieving a meditative state, but also influence our perception of time. Now to begin, we must identify limiting beliefs you hold about time, such as there's never enough time, or I'm always running late. Challenge these beliefs by looking for evidence that contradicts them and affirmations that foster a more flexible view of time. Shift your perspective on time from a scarce resource to an abundant and flexible one, just like we do with money. And reflect on past experiences where time seemed to bend to your will. Analyze these instances. It can help reinforce the belief in your ability to practice time manipulation. So you're asking, get to the good stuff. How do we do it? Here is a step, and I'll give you a practical technique with other different techniques that you can use. First of all, the step-by-step -step guide to folding time. First, set a clear intention. Begin by clearly defining your intention. Do you want to accelerate time during a tedious task or perhaps slow it down to savor a special moment? Having a clear goal is crucial. Secondly, a relaxed state of mind. Enter a relaxed state of mind through deep breathing or meditation. A calm mind is more receptive to temporal manipulation. Third, focus on the present. Bring your full attention to the present moment. Ground yourself in the now to gain control over your perception of time. The fourth step is mental time adjustment. Mentally adjust the flow of time. Imagine a dial in your mind that can turn to speed up or slow down time. Visualize this process in detail. Fifth is alignment with intention. As you adjust your mental time dial, align your emotions with your intention. Feel the excitement or calmness associated with the pace of time you're creating. And then six, the gradual return. After completing the task or experience the moment, gently bring yourself back to the normal perception of time. Reflect on the experience and any changes in your perception. There are visualization exercises that will aid in this. First, time expansion visualization. To slow down time, visualize a clock with hands moving slowly. Imagine the space between each tick growing longer. 
You can sometimes even look at a clock and watch it ticking and slow down the clock. This is a fascinating exercise. Just hold up a clock and watch the seconds tick and watch how it slows down or speeds up. Feel yourself moving within this expanded space. Secondly, time compression visualization. To speed up time, picture the clock hands moving rapidly. See the ticks happening in quick succession and feel the pace of your surroundings match the speed. Third, scenario practice. Regularly practice visualizing different scenarios where you manipulate time. The more you practice, the more adept you become at controlling your time perception. Additional techniques for manipulating time are time anchoring. This exercise involves creating time anchors, specific moments or sensations that you can recall to alter your perception of time. So you choose a moment where you felt time was either expanded or compressed. Relive this moment in your mind, focusing on the details and how it felt. Anchor this memory with a physical gesture or a word. When you want to recreate this perception of time, use your anchor to trigger the memory and the associated time perception. Secondly, rhythmic breathing for time perception. Rhythmic breathing can help manipulate your perception of time. This involves controlled breaths to either slow down or speed up your sense of time. So to slow down time, breathe slowly and deeply, focusing on elongating each breath. To speed up time, use shorter, quicker breaths. Practice this for 5 to 10 minutes and observe how your perception of time changes. A third technique is sensory time expansion. This technique involves using your senses to expand your perception of time. Engage in an activity that involves multiple senses, like eating a meal or taking a walk. Focus intensely on each sensory experience. The heightened sensory awareness can help stretch your perception of the moment. Four is the stopwatch exercise. This exercise helps in sharpening your ability to estimate and manipulate time. So you set a stopwatch without looking at it and you guess when a certain amount of time, like one minute, has passed. With practice, you become more attuned to the passage of time and then once you've tuned into that passage, you can slow it down. One of my favorite characters is Reacher, you watch on Amazon. And one of the cool parts of his character is he always knows the exact time in his mind. I haven't quite reached that point, but many of us could. Fifth is the visualization journey. Use visualization to travel through time in your mind, which can help in manipulating your perception of time. Close your eyes and visualize yourself in a place where time feels different. It could be a memory or a future scenario. Immerse yourself in this visualization, feeling how time moves in this space. The sixth is a time debriefing. Reflect on your experiences of time each day. Take some time at the end of the day. Spend a few minutes reflecting on when time felt fast or slow. Analyze what might have influenced these perceptions. This awareness over time can enhance your ability to manipulate time. You become aware of what you did to speed up time or to slow it down. Seventh is mindful moments. Just incorporate mindfulness into mundane activities which will alter your time perception. Choose an everyday task, like washing dishes, and perform it with complete mindfulness, focusing on each detail and movement. This heightens awareness can change your perception of how time passes during this activity. An eighth technique is time compression in learning. You can apply temporal folding to learn new skills or information. So while learning something new, visualize yourself absorbing the information rapidly. Imagine time speeding up, enabling you to learn in a condensed period. Nine, creative time expansion. Using creative activities helps to influence and manipulate time. In most cases, you can use creative activity to expand time. Activities like painting, writing, or playing music. You lose yourself in the process. You let go of the external sense of time, focusing on the flow and let time expanding naturally. And 10th, sleep time manipulation. Experiment with altering time perception during sleep. I've given myself the command, I want to live out the next year in my dreams. I've woken up completely living out the whole 12-month period in my dreams. So before sleeping, set an intention to wake up feeling as if you've slept a longer time than you actually will. 
Use visualization to imagine a long, restful sleep within a short time frame. Learn how that you can use your sleep state to manipulate time, both in things that you go through in your mind and in imagining or in visualizing for future experiences. As you become more comfortable with the basics of time manipulation, you can explore advanced strategies. First of all, extended visualization sessions. Begin to extend the duration of your visualization exercises. Try to maintain the altered time perception for longer periods, gradually increasing your control over the experience. Another is complex scenarios. Challenge yourself with more complex temporal folding scenarios. Imagine folding time in a high stress environment or during significant life events. These challenging situations can sharpen your skills. Another is simultaneous time streams. Experiment with perceiving multiple time streams simultaneously. For example, visualize experiencing a slow time stream in one aspect of your life while accelerating another. This advanced practice helps in developing a more nuanced control of time perception. One thing you have to do is navigate paradoxes. Recognize that manipulating time perception can lead to paradoxes such as feeling out of sync with your surroundings or experiencing dissonance between your internal clock and the external world. Resolve these paradoxes by gradually bringing your altered time perception in alignment with the standard time flow. Practice transitioning smoothly between different time perceptions to minimize dissonance. Also, engage in meditations that focus on achieving a state of timelessness, where the concept of time dissolves. This can deepen your understanding and control over time perception. I would incorporate energy work like Qigong or Tai Chi, which emphasizes the flow of energy in the body. Understanding and controlling this flow can enhance your ability to manipulate time perception. Advanced temporal folding strategies are about refining and expanding your skills, navigating the complex aspects of time manipulation and aligning with your deeper intuition. You can apply these techniques in every possible area of your life. You can compress time during work hours, enhancing productivity and efficiency. By accelerating your perception of time during mundane tasks, you can complete them faster and have more time for creative or enjoyable activities. You can apply this to extend moments of joy, such as family time or hobbies or relaxation. And you can use it to alleviate stress. In high pressure situations, compressing time can help you meet deadlines without the usual stress associated with time constraints. For instance, a corporate executive who uses time manipulation to manage a heavy workload without sacrificing personal time, resulting in a more balanced and satisfying life. Or a parent who uses time manipulation to cherish moments with their children, creating deep and lasting memories despite a busy schedule. Or the artist who expands time during creative sessions, leading to heightened creativity and productivity in their artistry. In experimenting with these techniques and researching for this episode, I recommend beginning small with short simple exercises and gradually incorporating them into more complex daily scenarios and each day with a reflection on how you used time manipulation techniques assess their impact in areas for improvement i see an incredible future with this we might see the integration of technology and enhancing these sort of practices when they become realized innovations in virtual reality or brain computer interfaces that could provide tools for deeper, more effective time perception manipulation. This can lead to enhanced cognitive abilities, expansion of the consciousness. And as more people try to manipulate time, our collective perception of time will evolve. It could lead to a society where time is not viewed as a limiting factor, but as a flexible, navigatable dimension. The new earth has a totally different view of time. This will lead to greater health, longevity, it will have societal impacts, changing how we view work, education, leisure, and relationships. It could lead to a more productive, fulfilled, and balanced world. So let's take a moment and we will try the temporal folding meditation so that you can manipulate time and begin this process of learning how to do this. Find a quiet, comfortable space where you won't be disturbed. Sit or lie down and gently close your eyes. Take a deep breath in, filling your lungs with air and slowly exhale, 
releasing any tension in your body. Begin by grounding yourself in the present moment. Focus on your breath, feeling the air as it enters and leaves your body. With each breath, feel more connected to the here and now. Now set your intention for this meditation. What aspect of time would you like to fold? Do you wish to extend a pleasant moment or compress an unpleasant period? Hold this intention clearly in your mind. Visualize a large cosmic clock in front of you, its hands moving in rhythm with time. As you focus on this clock, start to imagine that you have control over its hands. If you wish to slow down time, see the hands moving slower. If you wish to speed up time, visualize the hands moving faster. Now immerse yourself in the experience of your altered time perception. If you're slowing down time, feel the space around you expand. Moments stretching out like a vast ocean. If you're speeding up time, sense the world around you moving in a fast forward motion, events passing quickly leading you to your desired outcome sooner. Deepen your temporal experience by aligning your emotions with your intention. If you're extending a moment, fill it with joy and peace and tranquility. If you're compressing time, maintain a calm, detached perspective, watching events pass by swiftly without affecting your inner peace. Now say these affirmations with me to confirm your ability to master and manipulate time. I have the power to shape my experience of time. Every moment is under my control, expanding and contracting as I desire. I am the master of my time, effortlessly balancing my moments. Time bends to my will, allowing me to savor joy and swiftly move through challenges. With every breath, I feel more in tune and control of time. I can stretch moments of happiness making them last longer and feel richer. I possess the ability to accelerate time efficiently moving through tasks and goals. Time is my ally working with me to create a fulfilling and balanced life. I am attuned to the rhythm of life, skillfully navigating the passage of time. Each second is a canvas for my intentions, painted with the brush of my perception. I embrace the fluidity of time, adapting it to suit my needs and aspirations. My mind is powerful, capable of compressing hours into moments and expanding moments into hours. In my perception, time unfolds perfectly aligning with my personal journey. I am in harmony with time, gracefully managing its ebb and flow in my life. 
Every moment is precious, and I have the skill to make the most of it through time manipulation. Gently start to bring your awareness back to the present moment. Bring with you the feeling of control and mastery over time. This is just the beginning. Take a deep breath in. And as you exhale, slowly open your eyes. Spend a few moments reflecting on your experience. How did altering your perception of time make you feel? How can you apply this in your daily life? Remember the power to manipulate time lies within your mind and is accessible whenever you need it. And as we conclude this meditation, carry with you the understanding that time is flexible. You have the power to stretch and compress it through your perception, intention, and focus. Use this ability wisely to enhance your life experiences, making each moment count. You have the power to manipulate time. You can find all episodes of The Reality Revolution at therealityrevolution.com and welcome to The Reality Revolution.